Okay, so let me explain how to calculate KM, Vmax or how to solve a problem whenever uh, uh, problems are given in relation with uh, Michaelis Menten uh, kinetics calculations. Okay, so in, a, in my previous video, so I have explained you what is KM and Vmax. So here is the substrate concentration in the x-axis, y-axis you have initial velocity of the reaction. So it's a fixed enzyme concentration. So when you go on increasing the substrate, so it's going to reach a saturation. So velocity is going to reach saturation. This point is referred as Vmax, maximum velocity of an enzyme, half of the maximum velocity taken and interpolate that line to curve and then to the x-axis and this point is called as Km. This kind of, this video I have all, uh, based on, on this I have made a video in, in my previous presentation so you can go to that to understand better now the relation between substrate km vmax and initial velocity all this can be put together by this equation that is initial velocity equals maximum velocity that is vmax multiplied by substrate concentration divided by km plus substrate concentration this can be easily remembered by one of the method which is uh, given by Trey and uh, this is what is told to me by Amanda. It is like Victoria secret, keep secret. Victoria secret, keep the secret. So that's what is initial velocity equals Vmax into substrate concentration that is Victoria secret divided by Km plus substrate concentration, keep the secret. Victoria secret, keep the secret. Okay, so this is what is the, to remember this uh, equation. Now, this particular equation can be used to calculate Km of an enzyme, substrate concentration for enzyme or initial velocity of the reaction for that particular enzyme. Okay, and also this equation can be used to calculate transport velocity for a transporters, membrane transporters will also follow Michaelis Menten equation. So, this is Michaelis Menten equation. Michaelis Menten equation. Let's do some problem with this. Okay. So, the Michaelis Menten equation in, uh, consider that maximum velocity of the reaction Vmax is 5, maximum velocity is 5, substrate concentration is 2, that is S is 2, and Km is 1 and substrate concentration is again 2 here so that is 2 substrate concentration is 2 okay so what is the velocity of the reaction so now you know the velocity michaelis menten equation so initial velocity equal to maximum velocity multiplied by the substrate concentration over km plus substrate concentration so the maximum velocity is 5 substrate concentration is 2 km is 1 and again substrate concentration is 2. So, if you simplify this, you get 10 over 3. And if you further simplify this, you will get 3.33. And this will be the velocity of the reaction in moles per second. Sorry, if whatever the concentration of the substrate. This is how you can calculate the velocity of the reaction of an enzyme or the transport capacity of a transporter. Okay. So, this is we are going to do this using Michaelis-Munton equation. Thank you.